the LPGA Tour, with the weather-related fiascos of two recent events still fresh in players' minds, somehow can't seem to avoid controversies of Mother Nature's making. This week's ruckus came about after inclement conditions forced the PGA Tour to halt play for four hours during the second round of the CIMB Classic, and competitors sought any patch of practice array of grass at TPC Kuala Lumpur they could find to warm up for the resumption of the tournament. Every player in the field warning back up. Not even close to enough spots. Dudes are just making their own spots on random holes on the East Pick. Twitter.com a 6 hfr 69 no laying up at no laying up October 13, 2017. The problem, according to some players on the LPGA Tour, was that the guys tearing it up on the venue's East Course the men's tourney was on the West Course were doing so on the track where the women will play the Sime Darby LPGA Malaysia in two weeks. So annoying. But I can't say I'm surprised. Brittany Lincecum at Brittany won golf October 13, 2017. Similar concerns about potential divots marring the playing surface for the women when the USGA staged the US Open and the US Women's Open back to back in 2014 proved groundless. There were no divots, greens were in perfect shape. Eventual US Women's Open winner Michelle Wee said back then after playing a pre tourney practice round. I was surprised yesterday, there are no divots really anywhere near the green. The practice range looks fantastic. I think the practice facility here is large enough that it can hold two fields. So, yeah, I was very pleasantly surprised. Even so, it's difficult to envision PGA Tour officials allowing the women to take their hacks on a course the men were scheduled to use in the near future, as the caddy who was on the bag for Wise Open victory noted Wheat, by the way, is shaking the rust off her game at this week's LPGA Keb Hanna Bank Championship in South Korea, her first post-dependectomy action, and was one under and tied for 40th, 10 shots back of 36-hole leader Angel Yin.